Well, I guess I had a bit of a brain fart since I forgot to come here and pick up strength. Which I need to push around the boulders in the Silva Gym. So without this, I can't even challenge that gym leader. Ugh. Damn my stupidity, but... I'll just pick this up real quick, then I'll jump cut over to the Sunwood Gym, because quite frankly, I don't want to waste people's time surfing all the way back over there. So give me a minute, or a couple minutes, I should say. Well, I suppose it's once again to try and tackle this gym. But I have to wonder, how will I do? Because most of the Pokemon here are going to be like level 30, and I haven't really hit enough grind to get myself to 30 on Susie, so she might just get crushed right away here. Um, let's see. I'll try and get a confused right out and hope I survive the jump kick, but I don't got my fingers crossed really for it. No. Um, confused Ray. Please hurt yourself. Ow. Uh, no luck on that. Damn. Oh, good. Burn. I'll have lower defense and do less damage, which is always good. Um, another burn. Let's just keep burning them away with flamethrowers. <sighs> that was brutal, but that just leaves this guy with Hitmonchan next. Fear nothing, eh? Let's see if I can't make you afraid of me, at least. Well, I'm probably going to have to retreat back out to the Pokemon Center, though. Ugh. That's what sucks about having a team with only three in it right now. Um, look at the Confuse Ray. Come on, punch the face. Stop hitting yourself, man. Ugh. Come on, another hit to the face. Sweet. Though why is Ramon always so lucky? It's like the game's betraying itself. I brought it up before, but it just keeps reminding me of that. Why is a Pokemon named after a Digimon doing so well with confusion, while the Pokemon named after a trainer actually from the anime has so much bad luck with it? Um, I suppose luck shifts back and forth, but... It seems pretty consistent right now that Ramon's on a lucky streak. For the most part. And Susie is not. Might have to come back here one more time, actually. Depends on how much we get brutalized by the next trainer. Thankfully, I think he only has a Tyrogue, so... No way, he's probably got Mankey. Primate, maybe. Or is that the next one? I gotta take down four of these guys before I can even get to the gym leader. Jeez. Machop, okay. That's about evil with Susie, man. Sweet. Um, confused Ray. So I actually can outspeed this thing. Good. Come on. Ow. Half. Half damage there. Um, tail whip it. Come on. Blow to yourself. <sighs> Finally. Guess I can hope for another lucky blow, but no, 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 no luck my way. Except landing, ending up with one hit point, but that's probably going to be enough to finish it, and it's probably going to be unconfused, or it's not going to hit itself, and it's going to be game over for Susie. Oh my gosh! Susie got lucky! Nah, we'll leave Susie in. And then switch. Yeah, I know, this means I'm going to have to let him give a free shot in Flamon, but Flamon can take it. Flamon's a champion. Let's use Leer. Yeah, I gave up Headbutt for Strength. It offers slightly more power. And that's all I can say about it. Another Leer. Ho! Ho, 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 ho! So you know Rock Slide, do you? I forgot about that. And Flamon is out. Well, bring it home, Ramon. Bring it home. 
Give him a taste of your flamethrower! Just getting... Perhaps. I can give up Tail Whip technically for this. It would mean I wouldn't be able to lower my opponent's defense while they're confused so they can take more damage, but on the other hand, I can safeguard myself against, what, melee attacks? And support skills are nice to have, you know, when I support Pokemon. Let's face it. So I was like, giving up Ember, but I don't want to give up all my offense. I might regret having lost Lear at some point, or Tail Whip, sorry. But I ain't too worried about it right now. I wasn't expecting the fighting gym to put up so much of a fight, though. Ugh. Yeah, I know, crappy pun. Who expected their fists of steel to be such a challenge to me? Guess I should have leveled up a bit more. Yeah. And I'm gonna have to retreat after this to come back in here and fight Chuck. Dang. Thankfully, there's no one to challenge us in this next gym, so we'll be able to go right up and challenge the gym leader straight on. I think I'll prefer that. Now, let's see. Um. Safeguard. Hurt, but not that bad. Um, Confuse Ray. Come on. Oh, it missed. Good. Um, I'm not sure if it's going to be better off going with Headbutt or Ember here. Damn, well, since I'm low weight, that shouldn't be too bad. And Susie once again suffers from a lucky blow at the last second, I guess. I thought it was going to be knockout there, man. <sighs> man, these matches just haven't been going in her favor. Oh, luck right out of the gate. It was a solid hit. Come on. No, no luck there. And not even a one hit point survive, man. Oh, well, we'll send Flame on in then. Finish it with strength. I think it's not got anything left in it. Okay, let's see what you got, Primate. Um, Leer. Okay, not bad. Give you another Leer. Ow, that hurt worse. Okay, how about some mud in your face, then now you've dropped your defenses a bit. Uh, still accurate enough to land a blow there. How about this? Dang, and Fury Swipes has missed me on normal hits. Should've just went for strength for the knockout blow. Dang. <sighs> this may not go so well. Yeah, but you broke up most of my um, fire types, too. <sighs> and I can't really buy X attacks and stuff out here either, so I can't really power myself up for the gym layer outside of maybe grinding out some more levels and trying to get an evolution on my Quilava so I can use Typhlosion against him. But I don't want to go that route either. I mean, I'm here. And we're about on par level-wise, so it should be a close matchup. But if I'm willing to spend some potions in this fight, I might be able to pull it off. I'll be I gave up my best potion on the way here, my Moo Moo Milk. Yeah, we've come this far, all right. But can I beat you and shatter your bones? Because I really need to do that. 
What, has nothing to do with Pokemon? That's true. Yeah, you being physically strong means absolutely nothing. It's how strong your Pokemon are that's gonna matter here. All two of them. Okay, we got Primate to start with, level 27. We'll probably outspeed Susie, but I can try getting Confuse Ray on it. And hope it punches itself a few times. Come on. No, it used Leer. Darn it. Well, I can raise my defenses. And that of my team. Then go on the offensive myself. Not very effective. Let's try going for burn, then. Not likely, but I can try. I'm not too worried if Susie gets knocked out. So... I'll leave her in for now. Shoot! So close! I thought Susie might get the knockout, but darn, just not fast enough. Um, flamethrower. Let's burn you out of this fight. I might have to go with two on. I have to go three on two here. Oh yeah, Polyrath. Ugh, this is gonna suck. Because I know it knows water moves. Um, I gotta hope it hits itself a few times here. Because Surf doesn't suck, and I don't have the levels really to survive it. And even if I use uh, Cure Iron right now, it's still not gonna give me the strength to survive it. Dig ain't gonna really help me here, so I'm gonna have to hope for some lucky hits itself. Darn it. I might lose this. Hopefully I'll get lucky and it'll hit itself with confusion if it doesn't fade off and I can get some mud on its face. Mine, yes, self hit. Thank you, game. For a little mercy. <sighs> this is not a position I want to be in. Ah, come on, crit. So. <laughs> Jeez. Ugh. Oh, sh shit. <laughs> yeah. Forget Ember. And thank God we got lucky with Mud Slap. <laughs> I, I really didn't expect to win that near the end there. I forgot all about Polyrath. <laughs> oh, shoot. <sighs> uh, I'm one lucky mofo tonight. Well, that's the end of this episode. Until next time, then. See ya.